My name is Dominique and I have created a nonprofit. It's called Callie's Confidence. So what my nonprofit is, is I teach life skills for children in foster care and kinship care. And so part of the yearly event is Miss Crowned in Confidence pageant and brunch. So I hold it um, yearly. I haven't held it in the last two years just because of COVID, but my last one was in 2020. And so it's just to build these young ladies up. It's for them to embrace self-love, embrace confidence, teach them about self-esteem, just getting them out their shell. And so that's what we're um, doing today. I call my mother Big Shug because she's a little woman. I, I call her Big Shug because she played no games with me because I was something else, right? I was something else. I did not just become the woman that I am. I went through a lot. And when you're going through the system, you have a lot of fighting, right? Like our children are at times confused. They are struggling, right? Because they may not be like what their other friends are at school, correct? Or they may not have the family that they see at school or that they see at church. And they're going to challenge you. Right? So one of the things that my mother would say all the time is that I don't want to hear like, well, I provide this for me, I provide this for me, I provide this for me, thinking that they're going to behave because you provide something for them. They're going to challenge you at times. They're going to say, you know, is this my forever home? Is this where I'm going to be? How willing are you to, you know, rock with me? Because we do understand that they come from a background. Remember what I told you my background was, right? And although I was so young, Bloodline is serious. Bloodline is for real, right? So even though in your home you may not see those, you know, you don't have those behaviors or those things don't happen in your home, the young lady or the young man that's in your home is coming from that, okay? And so it got to be a lot of prayers. It got to be a lot of support. It has to be a lot of understanding. It has to be a lot of forgiveness. I have worked with children for over a decade, and so I love my babies. I have worked with them in um, different aspects of their lives. And so um, outside of social work and outside of counseling, I just thought, I just thought that the families needed more support. Foster care families need more support. Kinship families need so more support. Um, I used to work at a school, so I've seen a lot of aunts, uncles, grandparents raising their grandchildren, and sometimes they just need, you know, emotional support. They just need um, someone to vent, help them with resources. So that's what my nonprofit is for.